Here on the 208, we've taken you to map dots across the gem state, to places like cul-de-sac, bone, on away. Well, that spurred one of our viewers to ask us about this town. I heard that Riggins used to be named Gaojai. What? Obviously, there's a story behind the name. Well, what is it? That one was from Morgan, that question. And there is a story behind it, believe it or not. One that dates back to the mid 1800s when Idaho was in the midst of its gold rush. Let's get to know Gaojai, which is more commonly known as Riggins. At the bottom of one of the deepest gorges in North America, along the banks of the Salmon River, sits Idaho's whitewater capital, or what we all know as the friendly town of Riggins. But it wasn't always so friendly. In the 1850s, the town was once known as Gaojai. Rock Wilson, Riggins' unofficial historian, says a vicious saloon fight broke out between two men, Homer Levender and Big Markham. What were they fighting over? A lady, Daisy Trumbull, who just happened to be of marrying age, and the two men were fighting for her, well, affection. According to those watching the fight, Big Markham's eye was nearly gouged out. Jokingly, locals began referring to the town as Gaojai, and that name stuck until the early 1900s. In 1901, Dick Riggins applied for a post office in Gaojai, but was rejected because of its violent name. Some suggested the town be named after two of the area's most prominent families, the Clays or the Irwins. Wilson says those were rejected because, well, they were too common. So ultimately, Riggins was named after Dick, who became the city's first postmaster general. Well, there you go. You can still find pieces of Gaojai, by the way, in Riggins, including Gaojai leather, which creates handcrafted leather goods. Do you have an idea for our next Get to Know Idaho? Reach out to us on social media or by email, or you can just reach out to us through text. That number, 208-321-5614.